Hey there, if you've lost or forgotten the passcode for your iPhone 16, here's how you can factory reset it using a MacBook. A few things to bear in mind, this is going to wipe all of the data from the iPhone, so that's photos, videos, everything. Hopefully you have a backup or you're just okay with this. Secondly, if you were signed in with an Apple ID, when you set the phone up again, it's going to ask for the password for that Apple ID. Thirdly, we'll need a Wi-Fi connection so the MacBook can download the latest OS. And finally, if you use an eSIM, please contact your supplier to get a QR code to set up again. Okay, with that all said, let's get started. The first thing to do is make sure that the iPhone is connected to your MacBook. So I have a USB-C cable there and on the computer it's connected. Next, we want to power off the iPhone. So just press and hold the power button and the side button and slide off as you would normally. Following this, we want to power on. So press and hold the power button. Press and hold. I'm still holding the button. We have an Apple logo. Still holding. And now we have a restore logo. So I'll put the iPhone down now and let's turn our attention to the computer. Now you may have a message pop up saying it needs to do an update. Um, click OK, it will take a couple of minutes. Then head over to the Go button and go to Computer. From here on the left hand side, we have iPhone. Click that. We have this pop up box, and what we want to do is go to Restore, not Update, Restore. Are you sure you want to restore? We say restore and update. We'll say next here. We'll agree. And as it says on the screen here, your Mac is downloading the software for this iPhone. And if we have a look at the bottom, just here, it gives us an indication. As you can see, this is going to take a little time, so I'll pop back after. If during this process you notice that your iPhone goes back to the iPhone unavailable window and the download seems to disappear, don't worry. Just restart your phone as you did earlier. Power volume up, swipe off. Then we hold the power button again and keep holding. Just repeat what you did before. Go to restore, restore and update. And as you can see, it continues. Your iPhone has been restored to factory settings. Let's click OK. And as you can see, the iPhone is restarting. And once it does, you'll be able to set up as new again. So I hope you found this video useful and please give it a thumbs up if it has been useful to you. Thanks very much for watching my video. If you need a hand setting up the iPhone, I'll leave a link in the description to a video I've done showing you how to set up a new iPhone. Thanks a lot for choosing my video and I wish you a great day ahead.